Okay, the next one. Part two. Morning walk. Let's have a little prayer. Dear Heavenly Father, thank you so much for this new day. Thank you for blessing me that I could be in this beautiful part of the world, surrounded by nature. Thank you for all the blessings that thou hast given me. Thank you for the cool weather. Replacing that very hot weather. And please watch over the people in the world that are in pain or have deep sorrow or have trials that are seem insurmountable. Bless us all with strength to face our challenges. Bless us all that thou wilt be there with us. And we're grateful for nature. We're grateful for other people. And we'd like to ask that Thou will guide our feet, guide our mind, guide our hands. Help us to do good things and help others. And we're very grateful for all our blessings. These things we pray in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Middle of August is when the fingers of autumn reach deep into the dog days of summer. What do you think of this arch? Not a cozy spot. See, did this stay dry during the dampness of the night? Yep. Here we are, sinking into the ground. <laughs> I like this spot. This is really nice. I want to go back and check on that elderberry bush. Because the elderberry berries are ready, I think. I think some of them are ready. 
but not all of them. Most of them are still green. We'll worry about that tomorrow. It's not hunting season. This is August. What is it they're hunting or shooting at? A coyote? A bear? Hmm. These elders, alders, seem to be wanting to grow here. So do I let them grow and create shade? If they grow here, can I arch them over with that? They're not quite on the right spot. There's a gypsy cabin. I'm gonna have to go across there and around and cut the elderberry. I'm cut a path to the other berries. Alright, I'm going to turn this off and start a new one. Bye.